welcome to Garden Life, the channel for all of your gardening needs. Some people hate it. And some people love it. What do you think is it? Did you know that the best time to plant hardy perennials is during the winter? Some flowers favor planting in the winter. Learn how to winter sow outside in repurposed milk jugs in January or February to kickstart a lovely flower garden. Some flower kinds require a prolonged period of cold to germinate. Why so in the winter? For many perennials and hardy animals, now is the perfect time to sow seeds outside. For those of us who live in cold regions, we don't typically think of January and February as planting months. In order to germinate, many flowers prefer a period of cold rainy weather. Look at the natural world. Our favorite native annual, biennial and perennial plants are loaded with seeds that will fall to the ground where they will germinate in spring. Utilize this approach to either introduce new plants to your landscape or simply grow more of the ones you already have by following nature's lead. Fear not! Waxes, hormones, and thick seed coverings prevent the seeds from sprouting at the incorrect time. These are broken down by the repeated freezing and thawing in cold, moist soil, making the seeds ready to sprout in the spring. Which flower seeds should I plant in the winter? You can plant any hardy plant in your zone throughout the winter. These flowers thrive in the cold and don't mind snow or frost at all. Here are a few of my favorite flower seeds for January or February winter planting. Baptisia, Columbine Foxglove, Hollyhock, the Butterfly Bush, Budleia. Forget-me-not lavender, Alisum lupine, couple button, Coryopsis, and Delphinium larkspur. When it's winter. If you'd rather start the seeds indoors, you can mislead them into sprouting by placing them in the refrigerator for a brief time of damp cold. Either plant the seeds in the pots and seal them in a plastic bag before storing them in the refrigerator or another cold location for at least two months at a temperature below 45 degrees. Place the seeds in plastic bags with some damp soil or vermicellite if you don't want to keep pots of dirt in the refrigerator. Don't stratify dry seeds in the refrigerator or freezer. The two main components are moisture and cold.
The traditional way to winter sow seeds outdoors is to simply plant hardy perennials and annuals outside in reused milk jugs or water jugs in the months of January and February. One gallon jugs are simply sliced in half below the handle so that the bottom functions as a tray. Sow seeds in 2 to 3 inches of potting soil, add drainage holes, and then water. The jug's lid should be covered and ta taped to the base. Place the jugs outside now, protected from the wind but in the light. Let nature take its course. Search for seedlings in the early spring. Winter sowing is fantastic since it saves you time and money by not wasting it on attempting to grow leggy seedlings on window seals. The majority of the labor is done by nature, so you'll have sturdy, powerful starters. A cheap approach to expand your garden is by starting a mini nursery of perennials from seed, especially if you were able to acquire the seeds for nothing. You can use extra baking tins or trays. Be sure to create holes for drainage. In your tiny nursery space, seedlings can flourish all summer long before being put in the garden for September. The simplest approach to get to know your new plants and to remember to water them is to do it this way. Simply be sure to check on them frequently to make sure they are getting water and to make sure no other plants are crowding them if you decide to place them in the garden over the summer. Since they are perennials, the majority of native plants do not bloom in the first summer, but many do in the second. It can take longer for shrubs and slow-growing forest wildflowers. That's it for today's video on winter sowing. Share this video and like and subscribe to our channel.